should I be this close or should I be back here or in the middle? I love Kiera Shanae, man. Oh. <laughs> Kiera Shanae? Kiera Shanae is Come on. Ask Kiera Shanae. She gonna give you a tea. Cause I let my nuts hang low to the flow. In today's video, we have Callie and Michael Rainey Jr. So in my last video, we seen Callie and Michael in the club and I said if I see them again together, that will give me a reason to think that it may be a little bit more than just a little friendly link up. So they was recently spotted at one of her performances and they said that he was like on the side of the stage while she performed and they left together. Now, I ain't see that, but that's what uh, they say on Neighborhood Talk. So, uh, if this is inaccurate, head on over to them and tell them that this is inaccurate information. But it is a video of like, you know, I'll just show it so y'all can see it. So it looks like, you know, Callie and uh, Michael may be a new, I wouldn't say couple, cause you know, it's like the, the dating stage and then you guys become a couple. So they're probably like in the dating stage right now. Okay, so it's, it's Father's Day. So happy Father's Day to all the dads. Queen Naja had tweeted, being a father is not just about loving your child. It's about teaching them to be a better person than you were. The Shape Bros tweeted, the way some of y'all act in the bedroom you wouldn't, you wouldn't think you would have a father figure in your life. So that's his Father's Day tweet. <laughs> Happy Father's Day. The DDG and Hallie situation. DDG recently dropped the remix with Interly Chopper and Bia to I'm Geekin. And in the music video, he had a young lady over his lap and he gave her a little whooping. Okay? Like twice. Bat -bat. And then... <laughs> It was a little chatter on Twitter and the internet because, you know, people was like, oh, he's with Hallie. Why are you smacking another young lady's butt? But, 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 I just feel like that's, he's a rapper. So, he, it's just, you gotta charge it to the game. Like, that's just what rappers do. Um, I don't know if he had control over that. Some of his, Recent music videos was kind of like more modest. Like he wasn't around too many girls. It wasn't too crazy, but now they started to get more wild. So I don't know what's that about, but uh. And then Hallie kissed Prince Eric in the movie. So it's like, it's just, that's just what they're going to have to deal with. If you're dating an actress or an actor, they may have a kissing scene or a little, you know, in the bedroom scene. If you're dating a rapper, you know, you gotta be cool with the girls and the twerking and all of that in the music video. And you gotta be okay with the internet giving their opinion on it. On The Breakfast Club, Charlemagne God, which is Halle Bailey's cousin, he said that he can confirm that DDG and Halle is like dumb, broken up, right? Well, Roxy just informed me that DDG is no longer with my cousin Halle anymore. Mm -hmm. So being that he's not with the Little Mermaid anymore, he has to find some fishy box somewhere. I mean, I feel like DDG heard about what he said and then last night on DDG's Twitch, he said that they still together. So Charlemagne say, Charlemagne say y'all done, you say y'all still together. What's, and then he, he is her cousin. So who in his ear, you know, like that's odd. Maybe some more information will come out because if you family, bro, and you over here leaking stuff that you that probably ain't supposed to be out in the public and you got a big you got a big platform but DDG said they good so I don't know. Y'all comment down below what y'all think of that. And then I also have seen a clip of DDG just saying that he's not Prince Eric. He's not a Disney character and I feel like he's feeling the pressure of the internet and they want him to be this perfect guy and they don't realize that DDG is a troll. I am not a Disney character. I'm not Prince Eric, okay? I am not a Disney character, y'all. I do what I want, whenever I want. I have no, I don't care if she's a Disney character. That has nothing to do with me. Y'all choose to go in. He is a marketing genius. He's going to do what he can 
to make his stuff go viral. He know how to tweet something and, and, and have all the blogs posted. And he usually do it around the time when he released a song. You know, Halle fans just don't quite understand that. And I feel like that's that's an issue because it's bothering DDG because he addresses this almost every time he gets on Twitch. So if you're in DDG's Twitter community, they be like, Every day, every time he, he streams on Twitch, they, they're just tired of him going on these 10 minute rants. But it's like, it's clearly this 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 new stardom, this new fame that DDG has walked into, I don't think he was ready for it. Like you dating, you know, somebody that's huge. She is the little mermaid and she's more reserved. She's more chill, laid back, and he's kind of the opposite. He was kind of, being laid back at one point, but I feel like that's probably not really him. He wanted to get turned up, and it's like every time he tried to get turned up, he got everybody in his ear, everybody on Twitter, like, judging him. So I think that's about it as far as the topics. If you guys want to be added to the group chat on Instagram, just hit me up on my account, at Kiera Schnee, and then I'll add you. We'll be sitting there in that group chat talking about all your favorite YouTubers what they got going on and some of the stuff that I post in there is not going to be on YouTube because it's just too crazy for YouTube and YouTube is becoming more chill, more family friendly and all of that good stuff. So I'll see y'all in the next video.